everyone in this video we are going to talk about the ligaments of the elbow so this is the lateral view while this is the medial view so let's look at the lateral view first so we'll look at the annular ligament the annular ligament is a ligament that holds the radius and ulna in position so it spans between the anterior and posterior margin of the radial notch on the ulna Next we have the radial collateral ligament. The radial collateral ligament is a ligament that is between the humerus and the radius. It's between the lateral epicondyle on the humerus and it inserts mainly onto the annular ligament. But some fibers will also insert onto the supinator crest which is present on the radius. Next we have the quadrate ligament. The quadrate ligament will span between the neck of the radius and the inferior margin of the radial notch on the ulna. Now let's move to the medial view. So on the medial side we notice the annular ligament which we've already covered and next we notice anterior, posterior and inferior bundles. So these three ligaments together are known as the ulnar collateral ligament. So let's look at the anterior bundle first. So the anterior bundle is between the medial epicondyle of the humerus to the coronoid process on the ulna. Then we have the posterior bundle. The posterior bundle is between the medial epicondyle of the humerus and to the olecranon of ulna. Now it's very easy to state that the anterior bundle attaches to the coronoid and the posterior bundle attaches to the olecranon because that's exactly how the positioning of the ulna is. So if you know the ulna, this is how it's structured on the top. This is the olecranon. which lies posterior to the humerus. The humerus will sit here. And this is the coronoid. Therefore, the posterior bundle will insert onto the olecranon, which lies on the posterior side, while the anterior bundle will insert on the coronoid, which lies on the anterior side. And next, we have the inferior bundle. The inferior bundle is just between the anterior and posterior bundle. And together they are known as ulnar collateral ligament. So this is the lateral and medial view that we have covered. I hope this video was helpful. That's all we have for today. Thank you.